Okay, Paul, thanks for uh, joining us. Let's start with talking about the past couple of games. Obviously, we've had two games in just the past few days there. Uh, first of all, the Dumbarton game on Saturday. Uh, you managed to get on the score sheet and it was a terrific performance, wasn't it? Uh, it was one of the games everybody played well and sort of once you got a couple of goals ahead, everybody was sort of got the confidence up and it was really good just to see all the goals going. It's almost like exciting for the fans seeing all the goals going and uh, maybe the only disappointing thing for the guys at the back was that we conceded the, the goal, but in the... On that day, it's a it's a positive one for us. You managed to score a few goals recently, particularly in the, in the cup run as well. You managed to chip in with a few goals. Is that something that the managers keeping on at you to try and find the net more? Ah, uh, has been to be fair. He's been he's been sent to me since probably the start of the year, and you get more goals. And over the last few weeks, I found myself on the score sheet a couple of times, so it's just been good. It's something I want to keep up. In contrast, Tuesday night wasn't a classic, um, but you know, a point's a point, and it's a a further point. Up the table, isn't it? Uh, it wasn't a great game, but I mean, there's nothing you manage already said. Maybe at the start of the season, we might have lost that game 2 1 or something, but uh, uh, it's been it's a, it's a hectic schedule the next week or so, uh, four games in the two weeks, but uh, we're sort of on track to pick up a good amount of points, so that's what we want for the. For that. And from a personal point of view as well, you must be pleased with how you're playing, and really, you've been on a, a really good run of form for the past you know three months now. I'm just enjoying my football, to be honest. It's for, to be honest, in the last year and a half, it's been the most consistency I've had in playing in a team, and it's something I'm really, really looking for, really relishing, and it's something I sort of hope to keep up towards the end of the season. Obviously, it's still a wee bit till the end of the season. You're you're on loan from Celtic. Have you had any thoughts about what you want to do uh, next season, or is that something for a wee bit further? Uh, I think it's for a wee bit further than line. Just now, I just want to keep try to play well, try to get an aim at there, scoring goals, and then you just see where it takes you. This Saturday's uh, another big match against St Mirren. They've been on a decent run of form until, until the other night there when they got beat by Wraith Rovers. But it's, it's a place we've gone and, and won earlier on in the season, so you, you must be confident. I, we, we, we are playing on a really good run there ourselves, so we are, we're looking forward to every game, to be honest. We're, so we're going there just hoping to play like we have been playing and hopefully get a win. And St Mirren, a club that you've played with as well. You were there for a while last season. Um, it's... Obviously not nice to see a, a former club like like St Mirren down at the bottom of the table, but that's how harsh this league can be, I guess. Uh, definitely, they had a bad start and it's they're sort of paying for that now. They've been on a good run recently, but uh, I, th- I don't know, they've still, got, they've still enough games really, they can turn it around, but uh, hopefully they don't start turning it around against us. We've got, as you say, a busy period coming up and it must be just trying to finish as high up the table as possible. It looks like probably the playoffs are a wee bit too far away, but as long as we keep winning, you never know. I all we can do is just try and keep winning games. Just if somebody has a somebody has a disaster and comes back to us, then brilliant. Then that's what you look for. But uh, we're gonna try to pick up as many points as we can and see where it leaves us.